Auckland. Racing away from the 1950 metre marker. Footspora is first to go. Roman Courtesan is right there. Asiana is also in a good position. Goes off to lead them. High range is now on the move. Wild encounters in the White Silks. Roman Courtesan has been passed by Flaming Desire. Then comes Meg. Arizona Sunset and then Lungi. Mezzanotte is further back in the run. Catskill Queen is on the outside of runners. Then comes Leisure Lady as they go towards the 1400 metre marker. Asiana now leads it by two. High range is back second and Catskill Queen is on the move to race up into that second position. Going around them, Wild Encounter, Flaming Desire, Footspurrer. Then comes Meg, Roman Courtesan, Lungi's got the green cap, Arizona Sunset on the outside, then Mezzanotte, Leisure Lady, and behind that Miss Ferris is about 13, 14 lengths from top to tail. Asiana by a length and a half, Catskill Queen second at the 800, then high range, back and forth, Flaming Desire, Wild Encounter, Footspur is now being niggled out, then Meg. Arizona Sunset also on the move, now being asked to run. Then Roman Courtesan, who just sits quietly at the rail. Then Lungi Mezzanate, Leisure Lady and Miss Ferris. Top of the lane, Asiana by three. Catskill Queen second, high range. Leisure Lady, Flaming Desire. Arizona Sunset gets hooked out to the middle of the track. Asiana still leads it as they get to the 400 meter marker. Arizona Sunset is drifting in. That becomes the main danger and Roman Courtesan's now pulled off the rail. Still Asiana the leader. Arizona Sunset. Roman Courtesan's also trying to close them down. Arizona Sunset just the leader. Roman Courtesan on the outside. Arizona Sunset continues to find though. And Arizona Sunset has won it. Roman Courtesan second. Asiana third. Miss Ferris ran fourth. Number 13, Arizona Sunset. The McGar Comnaidu wins it, Anthony Delpeche. And this one is bred by Rupert Plersch. Wins by a length and a quarter. Ends up the toad favourite at 260. Second will go to number four, Roman Courtesan, 220 the plays. Third place, Asiano made most of the running. That's number six, that paid 140 the plays. And fourth to number five, Miss Ferris. Further back, Flaming Desire, Lungi, Mezzanotte, and then came Meg. Further back was Wild Encounter, Catskill Queen, and Footspurrer. We'll take a look at that head on shortly. So we managed to get the race meeting in. The visibility is really deteriorating, but it goes to Arizona Sunset. Roman Courtesans with the black cap back in that second position, and Asiana is towards the inside. Well done to everybody for getting through the race meeting. This is Craig Peters signing off. Well, it was over 1950 meters race number eight and uh, there were lots of also some form to recommend and one of those was number 13 Arizona sunset and really nice to see all the Sukrajas on course I haven't met up with the boys for a long time but uh, com yeah you know firstly well done uh, this filly she seemed like uh, she's appreciated the extra distance yeah D, she's quite a nice filly and uh, she is going to go further than this and uh, she, her two runs over the mile were decent she ran on both times and um, the extra distance straight wasn't the strongest of fields but she won a good race from the draw she uh, made up a lot of ground yeah she did you know she she tends to jump a bit slow uh and asked me before he says come can i go forward with this fully i said jock she does jump a bit slow but uh he, he rode her nicely he play, left her alone where she was and she's still a bit big baby she was green around the turn but ended up picking up to win a good race all owners, uh, you know, generally become uh, friends with trainers and the Sukrajas have been your good mates for a long time. Yeah, they're close to me, you know, more like family than friends. To all the boys, to, to Avi, that's not here, Sai and Tony Boy, 
uh, Uncle Ronnie Santos, the, the godfather. He yeah. always, he, the, the, chief. the chief. You know, I've got to say well done to him. And he brought some new patents into the yard to Ravin, to Farnaz, to um, Navir. You know, uh, nice to get them into the yard to be and Terence Giddy. You know, they afforded us the opportunity to take over this fully and teetotal. So really appreciate it and uh, hope the wins continue for them. Well, your stable's looking bright. Well done, Com. Yeah, going nicely. I must say well done to Anson, also to Gunter. Unfortunately, it was a bit of a mix-up with the rides, but uh, appreciate the two rides that he's given the fully. And uh, to show on to all the team at home, big team effort, and to our sponsors, Hollywood. Lovely. Com Nido. Let's get Jockey Del Pesh in, and it's a double for Anthony. Yeah, very uh, interesting race watching it on the monitor. Lots was happening uh, around the turn, at the back straight. Horses were moving, some were lagging behind, but you just were patient sat patiently on your horse. Yeah, I did. That's what happened when there's a lot of slow ones in the race. Uh, sure. They uh, can only go for so far and then they've had enough. And before the straight, there was a lot of bumping and everything. I decided now I'm going out. And, and uh, I didn't want to be that far back, but they did really go very quick the first part of the race. And I ended up getting a position. So I said, I'm going to stay there and then make my way out when it's time to go. And yeah, she's still learning. She's still looking around a little bit. She won a good race. And I think she, with more races, she'll get better. She's not going to finish a one-time winner. It's nice to see, uh, you know, get the extra distance as well because it wasn't a certainty. Yeah, you know, it's always good when you come in the ring and uh, you don't know too much about a horse and a, a trainer gives you a lot of confidence and say, listen, be positive, it will stay. And that's my style I like. When I know what I've got and what I can do, then I can, uh, you know, you, how much you can use the horse or you got to ride a patient racer. Com gave me a lot of confidence and he, he was bullish about her winning. Nice double, well played. Yeah, thanks very much to Comi. I like riding winners for him. Well done. Let's get Farzan in and, of course, the... Come through, boys. Come through, boys. Let's get all the boys. Come through, ma'am. You've made the way through. Your first winner? Yeah, first winner, first horse. Well, everyone says it's, it's a feeling that cannot be matched. How's the mood? I agree. <laughs> and uh, the, the, this fellow, you got involved with good family friends, the Sukrajas? Yeah, they're good family friends. Yeah, and uh, but where to from now? Any other horses in training? Um, just one more. One more. Well, I wish you all the best. It's, it's, it's a nice start to your ownership career. Well done to you, sir. Thanks. Uh, it's a good feeling having our first winner uh, six, six months into racing. We must thank the Sukrajas for giving us the opportunity to join the racing industry and I uh, hope we go places from here. Well, Ronnie and Santos are good guys and you're in good company. Thank you. I know that. Let's get uh, Laichi Sukraj in. Baya is here on course. He's going to represent Donny, who's here. Ronnie is here. Santos and Avi not on course. Well done, young man. Uh, thanks, Akadish. Uh, big thanks to Carmen. Uh, Anthony for great right. We're happy, this. The last time that you guys had a winner was at any price, a big, so your colors are doing well. Yeah, yeah, we're doing very well. Yeah, big thanks to come, this. Well, I know that your, your dad's not uh, too well these days, so he's on course, he's brave the weather and come through. Well done to him, well done to Santos, well done to Jabu, Tony Boya, yeah. and that boy, Cyan, I don't see him at the races these days. Where is he lost? Uh, this is at home, this is working, and doing a business, so yeah, well done to them, this. Well, well done, a nice one, young man. Thank you, Akadish. Lovely. That's uh, Baya Sukraj there, closing it off uh, with uh, number 13, Arizona Sunset. If you caught the score, there, 13, 4, 6, and 5. That's the way they crossed the line. Slight drizzle on course, nothing too serious. Uh, just cooling things off. But uh, a big thank you to Raymond Rogers and his team. Of course, Craig Peters calling all eight races. And a meeting will never go by without the mention of the hardest and best working cameraman on course who's done other than Zane. From myself, Dees Dainan, until we meet again, you take care. Enjoy what's left of your weekend. Salani Gashle.